Hi, I'm Henry. I want to keep making free games, and this is why. Most of the games you can buy on your phone these days cost only 99 cents. And it looks like PC games are heading this way too. This price does not in any way reflect the actual time and energy it takes to make a game. Some of these games are made by one person in a few weeks, but others take a team of people months or years to build. In order to survive, you either need a huge advertising budget, or you have to hope that your game somehow becomes a viral mega hit. You can't predict it, and you certainly can't rely on it. This system is broken. Then we have the so-called free-to-play games. Many of these claim to be free, but actually require you to spend money on energy or coins to keep playing, sometimes sacrificing the actual game design in the process. They can often use exploitative techniques, and this brings up troubling questions of addiction. This system is broken. You can try to survive using advertising, but ads distract you from the game. They take up part of the screen, you click on them by accident, and they're not related to the experience of the game. You need thousands of people to see them in order to make any money at all, and that money is coming from a third party with no connection to the creator or the player. This system is also broken. Now, let's say I get lucky and I manage to sell enough games to support myself. Some people will buy my game for $1, play it once, and then delete it, never touching it again. I still have their money, but there's no connection there. They don't know who I am or what I'm doing with that money, and they probably don't care. Even when it works, I think the system could be better. So what's the alternative? Well, the one I'm trying right now is crowdfunding. First, it's a pay what you can model, which makes a lot more sense to me. Some people are happy to pay more than the ubiquitous $1 price tag. Everyone's situation is different. It's also more than just an impulse purchase. You're making an investment in a real person because you believe in what they're doing. And finally, if the games themselves are free, then there's no need to worry about clones or copy protection or piracy. In fact, it makes sense to share the games as widely as possible and to encourage others to copy them and share them as well. After all, digital games are essentially free to distribute anyway, so all these artificial restrictions we've built up will continue to cause problems for us in the future. I'm not trying to sell a product with this campaign, I'm trying to sell a vision. In this vision, Creators and artists are free to experiment, to innovate, and to share their creations with everyone without worrying about how to pay rent. Products are great, but they're not as important as people. We need to help each other and create amazing new things by working together, as a space team, of course. If this philosophy sounds intriguing to you, then please share the campaign as widely as you can. These broken systems affect all of us, and I can't change them by myself. I need your help. And I'd love to hear what you think about all this. So join me in the forums or on Twitter, and let's start talking about how we can make this happen for real. Space out. Mm -hmm.